Ten minutes. You're the next comic. Mac Lindsay. Matt Lindsay. Mac. Mac. Yeah. Like a pimp. He's loud. All right, Mac Very Lindsay. Loud. Oh, taxi drop. All right. So guys, you guys just in time. I, I, I'm sorry I didn't get to catch my set, but it don't make a difference. I'm here all day. Uh, <laughs> this is my dude. You're about to come to stage. You probably guys seen him on absolutely nothing. But he's here right now on a tent at, at the mixed tent. And he got on a taxi driver fucking t shirt. One of my favorite fucking movies ever. Are you talking to me? Are you talking to me? Are you talking to me? <laughs> That's from the movie. I don't know. Uh, all right, everybody, give it up for Matt Lindsay. Lindsay. All right. There you go. Tell the fucking uh, introduction there. Uh, I don't even know this fucking guy's name. I'm just going to bring him up. I'm glad you spent your money to come watch someone who doesn't even fucking matter. Um, I'd like to talk about Spider-Man 3, the largest piece of shit made in the past two years. Big pile of fucking dog shit. What saving grace is Venom? I like that. A suit that comes from outer space and amplifies all of Spider-Man, Peter Parker, a fucking great American, a superhero. Takes all of his negative characteristics and just blows them up. Taking Spider-Man and turning him into a vain, narcissistic, vindictive fucking prick. It's almost as if that suit is made from the same exact material as my fucking girlfriend. She's a bitch! Uh, I will tell you this much, uh, I don't know how many of you have ever had your heart broke. I'm guessing some of you, if you listen to my typical romances, I'm sure you're gonna relate to having your heart stuffed in a thousand fucking pieces and we're just laughing about it the whole fucking time. I have Z ever had your heart broke? Hurt! Fucking hurt! Man, it's really painful. Uh, I would just like to say that uh, there's nothing more painful than that, getting your heart broke. Getting your heart broke, everything fucking hurts. Waking up, going to work, being around people, sitting in a tree, staring at her through binoculars. It fucking hurts. It's very, very fucking painful. And basically, I just do some really self-deprecating shit. I'll sit in the fucking my bedroom and jack off about this bitch who can give a fuck about me. Just jack and thinking about her. I feel pathetic. You want to feel pathetic? Just go to my pop and just bust on my own fucking face. Just, ah, I got so much self-esteem. Uh, don't even wipe it off. Don't have to because I am crying.